Hello again, Steve Martins. An exclusive walk with me. We are on top of Mount of Olives. My good friend Nuri Hawa dropped me off here. He is on a mission. And he said this would be a good spot to wait for him. Across is the Dome of the Rock. But my focus is on the Eastern Gate, the Golden Gate. It's where Yeshua HaMashiach will be coming back, as promised. Returning to his city, the capital of Israel. There are tombs up here. They look like they're fairly new. Last time we were in Jerusalem in September with my good wife Lori, Lori said these cost about $80,000. And the husband and wife generally are together in one tomb. Martin! Hey, there may be some Jewish blood. I've tried looking a couple times. IDA or DNA. I don't read Hebrew, maybe you do. Let's go over here. There are some spots available should you want to be buried on the Mount of Olives. It's only 80,000. Different levels here. There's a new grave over there. It's a nice day here in Jerusalem. November 10th, 2022. After three weeks, I leave here about 24 hours, head back to Charlotte, North Carolina. It might get a little bit of rain. It is that time of year when the rain falls from the heavens, blessing the land and the people. You can walk around the old city. Uh, Maybe an hour. I've done it once or twice. That is actually a Muslim cemetery across. And on this side of the Kidron Valley, which separates the two, is the Jewish burial grounds. We are over the top of Church of All Nations, Gethsemane Garden, and Tom Hess actually lives up there. We passed by his home. He has a 24-7 house of prayer. There are several here in the land in Israel, Jerusalem. Rick Ridings has Sukkot Halal. I think on my previous video I said Halal Sukkot. Oh, got to be a better tour guide someday. Get my facts straight. Temple Mount's been a point of contention for a while. The Jews should not have given it to the Arabs to control after the 1967 war. They should have kept it for themselves. Sometimes politicians do things you don't understand why. Lord help us. It's good to have Bibi Netanyahu, Benjamin, back in office as prime minister as he forms his government. And we are hoping that one who has blessed Israel in his presidency, Donald J. Trump will come back and do even more. And I don't mind saying that at all. Okay, hope you enjoyed this video. Check out the other 80 I've done here on YouTube. Steve Martin, Love for His People is the new handle, they call it so you can more easily find it. I hope you will like, subscribe, 
and share all these. Shalom from Israel. Jerusalem. <laughs>